Who will get one of these $1,400 stimulus checks that we just talked about the other day focused on seniors? That's what we're going to discuss in this video. Let's get right into it. So just the other day, I was out in a video talking about this new idea and proposal that's going to be drafted by the Senior Citizens League and will be sent over to members of Congress calling on them to issue a $1,400 stimulus check specifically focused on seniors. Well, over the last few days here, I've seen hundreds of comments from many of you down below asking me, how are they identifying seniors? Is this at the age of 60? Is it 62? Is it 65? So I wanted to come back with you and check in with the answer on this question. The simple answer at this point is... We don't know yet. I've done a bunch more research on this and I have not seen any answers as to how they are identifying a senior. They're simply just saying seniors. So there's no age attached to the definition of senior. So I'm gonna continue doing research on this and find anything else I can to help you out with this. But simply, they're just saying seniors with this. But either way, it's nice that they're sending out this proposal and absolutely, I will continue watching it and keep you updated as I get more information. However, one of the major reasons that they want to reach out with this letter to Congress is to get this additional stimulus check for seniors simply because they recognize, just as all of us recognize, that anybody living on a fixed income, whether a senior or anybody else who has low income or fixed income, is really, really feeling the pinch right now as a result of inflation and all of the rising of prices across the economy in goods and services. We know that inflation can be incredibly damaging and inflation can also be offset. Elon Musk is a firm believer in copper, which will be an integral part of the future. Why Elon Musk secretly loves silver. It's no surprise that Elon Musk has some revolutionary ideas. And by most measures, he has been wildly successful. Tesla orders hit a record 97,000 vehicles globally in the third quarter, not to mention 250,000 pre-orders of the new Cybertruck. In our cars, we do not use any rare earths originating from doubtful countries. Our engine mainly consists of copper and steel. This is a direct quote from Elon Musk, the CEO of Tesla, and also one of the most influential individuals of the last 20 years. Elon and his companies depend on a constant supply of copper, zinc, and silver. By 2025, there will be more than 5 million electric vehicles produced each and every month from Tesla, Nissan, and Volkswagen. That figure doesn't even include all of the other automobile or equipment manufacturers. Electric cars use significantly more copper than traditional internal combustion engine vehicles. For example, huge tech companies are going to need massive quantities of copper. Smart home systems like Alphabet's Nest Thermostat, Google and Amazon's Alexa and Personal Assistant will consume about 1.5 million metric tons of copper by 2030, which would be up from 38,000 metric tons today. Modern automakers are undoubtedly getting nervous about the imbalance between supply and demand. When I did my homework on this topic, I found that nearly every connection in a vehicle contains silver. Considering the relatively small global output of silver, it's astonishing that 55 million ounces of silver are used by electric vehicles. In fact, it's projected that electric vehicles will account for 49% of silver use in automobiles by the year 2040. Additionally, it is well known that the current administration is pushing hard for clean energy. As a result, to encourage this, they are creating incentives to promote the installation of millions of solar panels. These solar photovoltaic panels already comprise a considerable segment of the silver market, accounting for roughly 100 million ounces. As you know, clean energy is a huge, massive, gigantic opportunity to make money in an industry that is growing exponentially. On March 13th, 2020, our sponsor stock was 26 cents. By July 2nd, it was up to 68 cents, a 161% move in just three and a half months. By July 10th, it was up to 96 cents, another 41% move higher in just one week. 
On July 24th, just two weeks later, it was at $2.37. So that means in four months, March through July, it went from 26 cents all the way up to $2.37, an 811% move in just four months. Between January 4th, 2021 and February 1st, 2021, this very specific inflation game plan doubled in price in just one month. In order to buy shares of it, you would need to have an account with the established brokerage firms and not any of these new apps. So here's the backdrop to why both Elon Musk and myself believe in these commodities and why I personally think you must check out a company called Kalinex Mines. America's 20 largest cities have shot up by 19.08% year over year. In June, which is the highest pace on record, even surpassed the 2005 and 2006 sprint that subprime lending allowed. This type of housing boom is what creates money velocity, and money velocity is the catalyst for high inflation. With record low interest rates, I personally don't see how inflation remains transitory. I personally think we have a tsunami of inflation right in front of us. Clearly, not myself nor other Americans sense that inflation is actually transitory. On my channel, we talk a lot about infrastructure, green energy, clean tech, and zero emissions. But I have yet to tell you what I'm doing about all this. So today, I want to address this subject head on. If you're interested in the stock market and looking for opportunities to invest in companies that have the potential to rally, you should look into this. This is actually really important because we live in a world where not putting your money to work is actually a really, really big mistake. We also need to understand what the government is doing. So I want to add to this equation by telling you what we are doing, our personal action plan. So let's get into this. The 777 mine is the flagship mine for HUD Bay, and it is very close to where Kalinex owns a project. Kalinex trades under the ticker symbol CLLXF. Again, CLLXF. Get this, the 777 mine is the only mine that feeds into the processing facilities in town. In other words, this existing mine is crucial for HUD Bay and for the mining town. All right, here's where I got really excited. If you're looking for a stock market opportunity, pay attention to this. I believe Kalinex, who is the sponsor of today's video, has some massive upside potential. And again, they trade under the ticker symbol CLLXF. Again, CLLXF. A HUD Bay memo published last year stated that they plan to go from north of 700 jobs at the mine today to just 50 jobs by 2023. This is a big blow as HUD Bay has been producing for nearly 100 years. The only way to avoid reclamation is a new source to feed into the processing infrastructure. Kalinex Mines owns the Pine Bay Project, where their geologists drilled and found what is now called Rainbow Discovery. It basically represents this town's only hope of avoiding a major depression, which makes this project valuable. The Rainbow Discovery by Kalinex, again trading under the ticker symbol CLLXF, I believe has contributed to the massive 1,003% surge in the stock price since the March lows, and it certainly has the potential to be a standout as the world shifts toward environmentally sustainable growth. Kalinex Mines, again under the symbol CLLXF, is in the driver's seat of this project and the entire community is rooting for it. We could be on the verge of another major session for Kalinex, CLLXF, a period with consistent news, so I wanted to give you this heads up. Conduct your research on Kalinex Mines, CLLXF, which has found copper, silver, gold, lead, and zinc in their projects. There are currently two rigs operating to expand the rainbow deposit, closer to surface and at depth. News of drilling results is imminent. Therefore, if they're good, we've seen this stock fly up by a thousand percent in a single year. Also remember, since this stock trades under the ticker symbol CLLXF, it needs to be accessed with the traditional brokers.